Hey guys, some stupid sketch show guy here with another video. Now, you remember a few months back when I made a video talking about what they could do for the five new species they've announced for Select 2020? Well, now we see what they have done with those figures. And, uh, reality can be very disappointing. Like, Schleich has dropped the ball so far that it has reached the Mariana Trench. Because out of the five figures they have announced, only one is good. So, you, like, first you have the Augustinia, which is the least bad out of the garbage four. It lacks detail, but the paint job isn't absolutely ugly to look at. It just looks not that very detailed, you know? It just kind of looks a little cheap and kind of rushed. You know, it's five out of ten. Oh, well. But then there's the Ankylosaurus. Oh, boy. It has the same colors as the Schleich Stegosaurus, which is not a good thing. And it has such a weird pose. Like, look at it. It's just screaming like... With its tail up in an erect pose. You know, it just looks ugly, you know? It's just ugly. Then you have the Krylophosaurus, which, from this angle, looks really oddly proportioned. From another angle, it may look a bit better, but... Man, I really was hoping that Schleich did more with this Krylophosaurus. Like, I mean, sure, the colors aren't absolutely atrocious, but the sculpt is so cartoony. It just looks like a cartoon, and that's what Schleich was infamous for. And now they're just going back to proving that point. And then there's the worst of them all. The Postasuchus. Oh my f***ing god, this thing can join the ranks of the Schleich Acro. This thing is awful. I mean... You have this barf green osteoderms on the body, and this sh brown on the body as well. Just two ugly colors on a figure. And then you have the eyes. Man, that guy has seen some sh that's for sure. Well, at the very least, there's the Baryonyx. Now, the Baryonyx is the only good figure from these five. And I think it's well done. It's clean. It could have an articulated jaw, which is always welcome. I like the stripes on the body. And it's just a clean figure. It's well applied. Smooth. It just looks good. Man, isn't it kind of weird? For two years in a row, Schleich has had astounding Spinosaur figures with slightly less quality other figures. But then again, at least Schleich 2019 had more to offer than just a Spinosaurus with dental problems. Like... At the very least, Baryonyx has now got some fixed teeth. I guess Spinosaurus are the only ones with bad dental glands. So yeah, on the bright side, at least they fixed that. That's the only thing Schleich has improved from last year. They actually figured out how to make Spinosaurus teeth, or Spinosaurid teeth. Now, with one good figure, one okay figure, and three bad figures, do I now have lost all faith in Schleich? Most of it, but there's a small bit of me that says that maybe they can turn it around during the summer season. Let's hope and pray, because if they don't, then I'm going to go back to my opinion of Schleich before, which is that they are just dumb cartoony toys. Let's hope that they don't prove my point, and they redeem themselves this summer. See you guys next time. Agree with me if you want. Disagree with me if you want. I don't care. Comment down what your opinions are, and see you guys next time. Of course, how could I forget? Oh! <laughs>